are over here in Sumter Landing today in Pell City. I'm gonna walk y'all through this home. It is finished. It is the Everly floor plan, five bedrooms, three bathrooms, and priced at $369, okay? Anyways, for y'all that don't know me, I am Jessica Kirby. I'm a qualified broker, owner of JCB Realty, and I'm also a licensed mortgage originator. Number is 219-2371. Okay, so as soon as you come in, has pretty high ceilings. The first room is the um, owner suite. Has a huge walk-in closet. Nice walk-in closet. You can do either side, his or her. Followed by this bathroom. Love the bathroom. I love the marble, faux marble floors in here. It's got a double sink, water closet, separate tub and shower, pretty deep soaking tub. I like how they added, they ran the tile around. It makes it a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. Then you got the frame shower with the shampoo nook and the penny rounds for the tile. So pretty nice airy bathroom. And let's go through here and see what else the home has to offer. So you come into this nice open floor plan of the family room, they already had it pre-wired for you to be able to mount your TV above the fireplace. That is a gas insert fireplace with the island. I do love over here a little more in some of the landing than metal wood because you get the granite countertops and the same as little appliances. This also has a pantry, pretty nice pantry. This does not come with a refrigerator, but it does come with your microwave, your electric stove, and your dishwasher. Through here is your laundry. The laundry room. I like how they put the tile in here because they usually don't do that, so that's like a nice extra touch. You got your fuse box on this side, wash and dry hookup with another shelf in here. There's also room in here to probably add a little bit more shelving. On this side, we have the garage, the two car garage. It does come with the motor, which is a good thing. And two remotes when you do close. And this house also has the, yes, also has the half bath down here. Cute, cute. Okay. So that's pretty much what's downstairs. We're gonna go upstairs and look at the additional bedroom and bathroom. It also has a little uh, storage closet right here under the steps. So it's got pretty nice storage. And this house is 2,472 square feet. So as soon as you come up here, you do get the loft space. So if you have teenagers or just need like an extra spot for like an office, but need all the bedrooms, you can use this area. One room. Standard size closets. It's got an extra linen closet out here. Shared bathroom. I like how they did the tile on the floor in here as well. It's a pretty good size standard bathroom. Another room, I'm sure a standard size closet. Nice and 
landscape. Okay, let's go across the aisle. So it's just like, I guess, a little extra space right here. And a, another room. A little bit bigger of a closet in this bedroom and this bedroom is kind of away from everybody so if you have like an older child this will be like a good room for them you know they like their personal space you can do a little something right here in this extra area that they have and there's another bedroom up here like a second master I would say there's a bathroom in here so it's got another full bath up here it's about the same size as the other bathroom that's up here and standard closet the room is kind of oddly shaped so some people may use this as maybe like a playroom or a media room or a man cave or something like that all that work these are just attic spaces right here they got the window so this will be just kind of got to be creative with this if you don't want to use it as a bedroom but i like that it has the bathroom in here so downstairs is the master with the bat with the bathroom the kitchen and living room then upstairs is four bedrooms two full baths so i mean i think this is a lot of space they use the 2400 square feet really good i've seen other builders not use the square footage as well as this one but this one is 369 they have a preferred lender that's offering a 5-1 buy down which means you can get like a 5.9 percent rate I'll drop that information in the comments. I um, forgot the name of the lender. This is a new lender that they're using. It's not the same one that Newcastle is using from Sumter Landing. So, no, from Meadowbrook. Sumter Landing has a different one. But I will drop that information down. I'm also a lender as well. So, I will drop our programs down there as well. So, you can pick the preferred lender or this one, whichever one you like. They're building several homes over here. So, if you don't particularly like this floor plan, but you like the build or the builder just reach out let me know we can come over here and see what they have to offer i don't think they do many like changes but we can always ask um they are there is a few homes left over here and there's still three homes left in the cheaper price range um like if you're under under 300 in the other subdivision is down the street. So all of these is in, all, all of these are in Pell City, Pell City School Systems. Uh, we know Pell City is up and coming. They have a new shopping center. So I, this is definitely a good area to invest in. If you are interested, please hit the comments below and let me know and I'll reach out to you, okay? Thank you. Bye.